Looking to find the love of your life from the Philippines? Well, you've come to the right video. Hi, welcome to Online for Love, your number one resource for dating by the numbers. Today we're going to be going over Filipino Cupid, a website that's dedicated to finding individuals who are interested in Filipino singles. This website was previously known as Filipino Heart and it was known for connecting Western men with Filipino women, but is it still like that today? Let's check out the video to find out. However, right off the bat, if this doesn't sound like a great online dating website to you, then I highly suggest you take our online dating website quiz. This quiz will ask you some personal preference questions as to what you are looking for in a great online dating website. At the end of the quiz, I'll let you know exactly what that result is. If you'd like to take this quiz yourself, you can do so by jumping down in the description below or by clicking the link above my head. Now, after you've taken that quiz, be sure to check if your result is on our deals page. Our deals page hosts multiple different online dating website discounts for those individuals who are interested in saving money. Who the heck is it? So if you'd like to save yourself some money, check out our deals page in the description down below or again by clicking the link that's popping up above my head right now. Now with that being said, in order for me to go over Filipino Cupid, I've broken it down into these five categories so it's easier for you, the user, to digest. Those five categories are the features, the user demographics, the prices, the ease of use, and the success rates. So without further ado, let's jump into the number one on our list, which is the features of the website itself, which we're going to start off with the sign-up process, which is very simple, easy, and shouldn't take you longer than three minutes. The sign up process will ask you some basic information like your first name, your email address, and your age. And from there, it'll lead you on to setting up your profile of which you can add some information and set up some profile pictures. Now, using all of the features on the website is really geared only for premium members. However, free members can use this website too. When it comes to making contact with other individuals, you simply click on their profile and it gives you five main options that you can use to interact with their profile. The first of which is simply sending them a like, a feature that's available on most other online dating websites that are in existence today. Sending them a like simply lets you know that you like them and it'll actually send them a notification letting them know that. However, if you want to take it a step further and really let them know that you're interested, then you can send them a favorite. A favorite will actually add them to your favorites list and it will also notify that user as well that you are particularly really interested in this person as you did add them to your favorites list. And the other method of contacting them is a really simple, straightforward method of simply sending them a message. However, messages aren't geared for all users and they can be geared for you free users as well. Let me explain why. So if you are a free user, you can send a message to anybody, except if you send it to another free user, they won't actually be able to read the message you sent unless they sign up for a premium membership. However, if you are a free user and you initiate contact with somebody who is a premium member, then you'll be able to freely speak with them. And of course, premium members will be able to communicate between each other no problem. Going back to their profile, the other two features that it allows you to utilize on their profile is to be able to report them if you are suspicious of them being a scammer or some sort of catfish. And if you just don't want to interact with this person, person ever again, they do offer a block feature as well. I really do think those two features are an excellent addition for any online dating website as it keeps the community safe and it makes the experience for all other users on the website a good clean one. Filipino Cupid also possesses a very detailed matchmaking algorithm as the profiles on this website are extremely filled out and they're filled with information that include things like somebody's hair and eye color, all the way to if they smoke and drink, all the way to what their religion is, what their hobbies are, a ton of different qualities that you can find of a person simply just by looking at their profile. Now, because all of these profiles are filled out with all of this information, all that information is utilized in their search and filter feature. And of course, premium members do get a way more in-depth search and filter feature. However, free users do actually get a really in-depth search and filter filter feature themselves as well. And again, you can search for people based on a bunch of different qualities of them, like their height, their weight, what they uh, look like, how they consider themselves in an income situation, how fluent they are in English, so on and so forth. Apart from that, you can also change Cupid tags as well. Now, Cupid tags, you can think of like hashtags. So let's say you are really interested in cooking and you really wanna find somebody else who's interested in cooking too. You can add cooking to your profile's Cupid tag and any user who searches cooking, you'll end up in their search results. And vice versa, if you are looking for somebody who is really into cooking, you can simply search a 
the cooking cupid tag and it'll come up with results of people who added cooking cupid tag onto their profile. Filipino Cupid also has a really special feature as well for those premium members and it's messages translation. Now this is a special feature where if you are interacting with somebody who doesn't speak English and they only send you messages in their own language, this will automatically translate their language into English for you so that your dating pool isn't actually going to be affected by the language barrier, which I think is pretty awesome. They also have another section which is great for those who are interested in marrying a potential match that they make on this website and they actually require you to fill out a form. That form is called the International Marriage Broker Regulation Act or the IMBRA and users will need to submit their marriage and criminal history so as to keep everyone who is using the website safe from stalkers, predators, abusers, and so on and so forth. Filipino singles will cross-reference that information that you give them and if you pass their tests that information will be available publicly on your profile for all other users to see. And before I move on to number two on my list, I do want to ask you guys to make sure you are liking and subscribing to this channel. Seriously guys, it really does help us out with that YouTube algorithm and we super duper appreciate it. So this moves me on to number two on my list, which is the user demographics of Filipino Cupid. As far as the total number of users on this website, there are a ton with 5.5 million in all. But where do these users actually come from? Let me rank out the top five countries that these users are located in. The first of which is the United States with 34% of users. Second of which is the Philippines with 13% of users. And then Germany with 7% of users. Then France with 6% of users. And then Australia with 5% of users. As you can see, the largest portion of users is actually coming from the United States with the second largest number of users coming from the Philippines. Simply put, if you aren't from one of these five countries that I put in the list, you're going to have a much tougher time finding success on this website than other individuals. And as far as the male to female ratio goes on this website, it's pretty close down the line, about 50-50. Now again, I do want to ask you guys to make sure that you are hitting like and subscribe in this video. Seriously, it really does help us out with that YouTube algorithm and it ensures that our video is being pushed out to more users who can get some more great information from us here at Online for Love about the online dating world. So this moves me on to number three on my list, which is the pricing of Filipino Cupid. And there's actually two types of premium memberships that you can sign up for and that's the gold and the platinum respectively. Now gold members get some added benefits and this includes you being able to communicate with all users on the website whether they are paying or not. You no longer see any ads. You have the ability to browse anonymously and you'll receive a VIP support when needed. Now platinum members get all of those benefits plus they get these added benefits as well. They'll be ranked above any other member and seen more on the website. They'll be able to put twice as many photos on their profile. Their profile will be highlighted among other users. They'll get access to in-depth matchmaking algorithms and you'll get messages sent to you automatically translated to English if they're not already. You are interested in becoming a gold member on this website. The prices look like this. For one month, it'll cost you $34.99. For three months, it'll cost you a total of $69.98 or $23.33 per month. For 12 months, it'll cost you $139.99 or $11.67 per month. And for platinum memberships, the prices look like this. For one month, it will cost you $40.99. For three months, it will cost you $79.98 total or $26.66 per month. And for 12 months, it will cost you a total of $159.99 or $13.33 per month. Now, if you'd like to save yourself some money on multiple different online dating websites that are out there, you should definitely check out our deals page. Our deals page offers multiple different online dating website discounts for multiple different online dating websites. So if you'd like to save yourself some money, who the heck doesn't, be sure to check out our deals page. Now this moves me onto number four on my list, which is the ease of use of Filipino Cupid, which I am very happy to say it is very simple, straightforward, and easy to use. It's really simple to navigate through this website. And I honestly never felt lost trying to search for what I was looking for. Now again, this website offers some really detailed profiles, as I said earlier, and you can actually see if a profile is verified or not by the website by seeing the little check that is next to their user. If you'd like to get your profile verified yourself, you can do so by uploading a form of government ID such as a driver's license or a passport. You can also easily recognize premium members as well as they will have a little symbol next to their name as well. As far as profile pictures go, they are completely visible for everybody on the website, whether you are paying or not, which I think is fantastic because if you want to search the website for free first before you pay money into it, you can absolutely do that with this website. And again, as I just mentioned, these profiles really are in-depthly filled out with an about me section, with what they're looking for, with different features about them, like their height, their weight, their eye color, their hair color, whether they're smoking, drinking, etc., etc., etc. And along with browsing their actual profile, I do also 
also have match indicators. Now, if you are looking for a particular feature in them or they're looking for one in you and you match each other, then they're gonna have a green indicator box around that information. However, if you don't match their criteria, such as if you're outside of the age range that they're searching for, that box is going to be red instead to let you know that you don't exactly match the kind of person that they're looking for. And then down at the bottom of the section, you can see a bit more in depth about what they say about themselves as they can write their own personal prompts as to what they want to say. Across the top of the main page, you can see tabs including the current members online, your matches, search, messages, and activity tabs. And on the right side, you can see your settings, your profile setup, and lastly, a little globe that will give you information on the different types of websites that Cupid Media has to offer. In comparison to other online dating websites, I really do think that this website is set up beautifully. It's really easy to navigate through and it's not filled up with unnecessary clutter that won't help you in the online dating world. And whether or not you're tech savvy, I think you're going to have a great time using this website as it's really simple to navigate through. Again, I do want to ask you guys to make sure you're hitting like and subscribe. I super duper appreciate it. And this will move me on to number five on my list, which is the chances of having success on this website. Now, the first factor that I'm going to include in this is if you're based in a location that are, where there are a lot of users. Obviously, if you're around a lot of other users who are using this website, you're going to have a better time with it. And if you are from the United States or the Philippines, you're going to have a much better time using this website than people who are from outside of those countries. And as far as the male to female ratio goes, it's about 50-50, so both sexes are going to have an equal time finding the opposite sex on this website. And lastly, the people on this website are really looking for a long-term serious committed relationship. So if you're looking for something that's more on the casual side or a hookup, you're definitely not going to find it on this website and I'd suggest you search somewhere else. And if you need help finding that other website, again, I do suggest you take our online dating website quiz. This quiz will ask you some personal preference questions as to what you're looking for in an online dating website. And at the end of the quiz, it'll let you know exactly what that online dating website is best for you personally. And after you've taken that quiz, be sure to take that result and bring it to our deals page because our deals page hosts discounts, not just for one website, but for multiple different online dating websites. And hopefully the result from your quiz is available on our deals page. With that being said, if you guys would like to see more content from us, be sure to check out the two videos that are popping up on my left and right here. And I did want to ask you guys if you have used Filipino Cupid before and what your experience was on the website. Was it good? Was it bad? Was it eh? let me know in the comments down below. With that being said, if you guys could leave a like and subscribe so you can see more information from us here on Online for Love, I would super duper appreciate it. All right, see you later.